Brought to you by FastFlight, your complete aircraft management software at an affordable price. And by Aspen Avionics, a new way to look at avionics. And by XMWX Satellite Weather, never fly blind again. Glenn Pugh for AvWeb.com. It's been almost exactly one year since airshow performer Kyle Franklin lost his wife to burns she suffered after their crash together in March 2011. The following excerpts are from my conversation with Kyle on March 26, 2012 at the Sun and Fun Fly-In and Expo at Lakeland, Florida. You know, day by day not having Amanda by my side is really tough because she, she and I, we, you know, we work together, live together, I mean, we were together 24-7 and you know, our, our business office was our home so we were together all the time and not having her by my side this past year and forward has been extremely difficult and challenging. I mean, it's, it's hard to describe unless you've been there. I mean, it's just, uh, it's been a real, real struggle in some aspects, but I'm getting through, you know, I just need some time and I'm getting through moving forward. But, uh, you know, it's, you know, the scars are always there with you. Yeah, you know, looking forward this year, I'm back out doing doing the acts with the Super Cub. Um, no, don't, I wasn't pushing for a real big season this year. I'm doing about 11 shows this year, and that's about as much as I wanted. Uh, because also, I've got a new airplane I've been working on for about eight years. It's going to be finished come July, August, somewhere around there, and I need to learn how to fly it. It's a one-of-a-kind airplane. My dad designed it. He and I started on it, and it's taken forever to finish it, but it's almost completed, and it's another biplane. It's something that uh, some people know about and been looking forward to for a long time, and once it's finished, I think everybody's really going to like it, and I plan on having it for 2013, and it'll, it'll be in the traditional Franklin tradition of being very unique and very different. As soon as I get this new airplane finished and that project's done, I'm going to focus back on the mystery ship again and getting some of that, getting it, getting it back in the air. That airplane's been in this business way too long to end its career on that note. I mean, this is, this is rolling on 46 years for my family in this business. And uh, so it's, I'm not going to let that airplane end, end like that. So I'm, I'm still out here and I'm still going. But I tell you, it's been, it has been an extremely tough year. Because, uh, you know, personally and business-wise, I mean, I lost, you know, my better half, basically. I mean, she just, everything to me personally on that. And then business-wise, you know, we, she and I built this small empire between the two of us. And me trying to run everything and trying to keep up with everything myself has just been almost impossible. I mean, I get as much done as I can, but between trying to keep up with business paperwork and keep the machines running, and it's like I'm out here today putting the airplane together, and normally she and I, could, we could put this airplane together in an hour and a half, the two of us, and you know, pretty much just me grabbing a little help and everything. It takes me about three hours to put it together now, so it's, uh, it's, definitely, it's definitely been a challenge, but all you can really do is move forward, and uh, you know, I know she's always here with me one way or another.